YouTube, what's going on? This is Ace with Gaming Hookup, and I have a quick Deatomizer Strike gameplay. I'm using the MV4 Fallout Elo Quick Draw Silencer Basic, man. You want to make sure you have Ghost, Blind Eye, Scavenger, and I'm using Dead Silence with the personal radar because I am playing in hardcore. Now, I do apologize. This gameplay is in 720p upscaled to 1080p because I was not expecting to get this Deatomizer gameplay. This was a warm up game because I'm getting ready to stream, but I wanted to talk about something that kind of sparked my interest. If you haven't dropped a Deatomizer, strike in infinite warfare yet you probably have given up don't give up though i got a couple of tips i want to help you get your deatomizer strike before call of duty world war ii comes out we're about six or seven days away i'm not looking at the calendar it's an estimate basically the first thing you want to do is you want to figure out what map you play best on that's the biggest thing now you also got to figure out do you get more kills solo or in a party so once you figure those things out when you get on your map run with this setup and if you're if you're able to play in hardcore i recommend playing hardcore frontier and you can get in their spawn if you get play solo get them in their spawn your team's sitting back and they're not rushing they will keep spawning in this location now it is a little bit of a cheap de atomizer strike i'll be honest with you it's not my best most impressive de that i've dropped but i did it in about 180 seconds solo not even warmed up so you can get a de atomizer strike if you haven't gotten one I don't care what your skill level is, if you could at least go positive in the majority of your games, you could drop your deatomizer strike. If you need help, get with me. Get in the live stream, add me on Twitter, Gaming Hookup YT. I'm definitely willing to help you out. I'm not that good of a player, to be honest with you, for you to give me your account information. It'll take me hours upon hours to try to drop a deatomizer strike. I usually drop a majority of my strikes without even trying, but you can do it. Real simple, all you have to do is figure out what's your best map you play on. Do you play better playing solo? or in a group and then you gotta also strategize with your group if you're playing with somebody make sure you're running non-lethals the whole group has to follow a strategy or it won't work that's why i get a majority of my deatomizers solo now i got a little bit campy at the end and sometimes you have to do that you know what i mean i'm playing solo uh, my team's not being aggressive i don't want to be overly aggressive at this point i'm only a few off bam i need one more so now i'm gonna definitely sit back you know what i mean i'm gonna relax Bam, I got my Deatomizer Strike. Another advanced UAV. I'm not using my RC8. I was only running RC8 because when I play solo, I want to win. And then boom! Oh, I get hit by a landmine. I've seen that too. I was being a little rushy there and excited. But I wanted to try to drop, drop a Druggernaut, you know, and I wasn't able to do that. But again, guys, don't give up on trying to drop your Deatomizer Strike. If you're someone that enjoyed, you know, Infinite Warfare all year long, it's something you want to accomplish. And, you know, if you don't care about it, fine. But if you need help, I think you can drop it. You just have to strategize. With that being said, guys, this is Ace with Gaming Hookup. I hope you enjoyed the quick gameplay. I'm going to be streaming. I'm going to drop this video before my stream. So you may or may not see it until after. But I appreciate you viewing the video. Make sure you subscribe. Slap the notification bell. And also like the video. It helps us grow, guys. And I'm out.